Hey everybody, it's I Want To Be Retro. Today we're going to take a look at installing N8N on Windows. To get started, we need to download the Node.js MSI installer. Navigate to the Downloads directory and launch the Node.js installer. Click through the installer, accepting all the defaults until you reach the Tools for Native Modules screen. On this screen, make sure to check the box before clicking Next. Wait while Node.js is installed. After clicking the Finish button, the Tools for Native Modules installer will be launched. Press a key to continue with the installation. This installation process takes quite a while, as it downloads and installs about 3GB worth of packages. Just be patient and wait for the success message to appear. Then press any key to exit the installer. We now have Node.js installed and configured. Launch File Explorer and navigate to the folder path in the video description. Right-click on the RT Backup directory and select Properties, then Security, and Advanced. Click the Change option next to Owner, then type Administrators and click OK. Check the box to replace Owner on Subcontainers, then click OK. Click Yes on the pop-up to confirm changing ownership. Next, launch PowerShell as Administrator. Run the command npm install n8n dash dash location equals global. Wait while Node.js downloads and builds the N8N application. When the installation completes, run NPX N8N to test running the app. If no errors occur, press Ctrl-C to kill the process. Now we'll set up N8N to start when the computer starts. Click the Start button and search for Task and launch Task Scheduler. Click the Task Scheduler Library folder in the left pane of the Task Scheduler dialog. Then right-click in the white space and create basic task. Name the task N8N and click Next. Select When the Computer Starts and click Next. Click Next, then paste the path from the video description to mpx.cmd and add the argument N8N. Check the Open Properties dialog box and click Finish. Select Run whether user is logged on or not and Run with highest privileges, then click OK and authenticate with the user's password. Right-click on the new N8N task and select Run. Open a web browser and navigate to the DNS or IP address of the host, colon 5678. Set up an owner account by entering an email, first name, last name, and password. Then continue by clicking the Next button. Answer the questionnaire, and then click Continue. Welcome to N8N Workflow Automation, running on Windows.